What's up everyone? Thank you all very much for tuning in. I hope you enjoy this video because it is definitely something different and unique on this channel. I am starting to think outside of the box as a YouTuber and with the holidays coming, for those of you tuning in, Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays and also Happy New Year's very, very soon. This is going to be released on December 25th of 2018, as you guys can already see. And this is a Christmas-themed video um, on a Steam game called Adolescent Santa Claus. It is anime-looking, and that's the only reason why I chose it. I basically searched in Christmas, and uh, I, I sorted it by uh, free-to-play. I looked at all the free-to-play, and the thumbnail on this is anime-related. A little bit of, it's an anime female with brownish hair other than that it has good reviews it's very positive recently released this year so it's a new game so i don't think many people have played it on youtube i've never really looked into it and i have no clue what this game's about um i just hope it's decently fun or entertaining for you guys to watch so without further ado let's go ahead and check it out Alrighty, everybody so we are now in the game i have no clue what to do except click on story uh I believe this is a Korean game translated into English, so bear with me. Christmas Eve. I was in my room, staring off into the... Oh, it's one of these games. Okay, this is... Okay, so before we get into this, this is like a storyline, storyboard type of game. It is... I don't know what they call these, but it's not really a game. I think it's just a story, so... We'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. The room was as plain as it gets. Uh, I'd say it's a little bit cooler than some rooms. Uh, no noise. That, that, that's true. There's really no noise going on. No color. I see some color. That's kind of a lie. And not even a smell. <laughs> Smells like air. What's the big deal about Christmas anyways? I... I, I don't know, fam. I don't know. It, you, you get to spend time with the fam. Uh, you get to spend time with the friends. You get gifts. And you give gifts. And th there's a deeper meaning behind it, but I'm not going to get into that. Everything is so stagnant. Nothing ever changes around here. I let out a deep and drawn out sigh. Now that I think of it, there was once a more innocent time when I used to believe in Santa Claus. That is true. I like how the, the little... Um, thing at the end of each sentence to say that the sentence has ended, not the period part, the one after that, is a nice little Christmas-themed snowflake. So far, that's the only thing Christmassy that we got, besides the storyline. Santa. Will he ever come? He probably won't. I'm no longer a kid, after all. Phew. After letting out a sigh, I rolled over. Once I did so, there was... There was what? Ooh, we have. Oh, shh. This, so this is the. Okay, so it's it's in Korean. I, I understood some of the words she just said. I mean, it technically says what she just said. Give me your gift. Wait, what? Santa. Who's Santa? Is that me or is that. I don't know who this is. I'm kind of confused. There was a kid version of Santa Claus. Wait, is she, is she Santa Claus? Am I, am I the one that was talking this whole time? What is going on? She suddenly popped out, demanding a gift from me. That made me flinch a bit. Kinda did. I, I really love anime. I'm not gonna lie. I just love the drawings. I just like how, I don't know. I just like I like female anime characters. I don't know why. <laughs> the only reason why I chose this game is because of her, pretty much. No, hang on. Where did she even come from? In from? There was, she wasn't here a second ago. Well, I know that. I'm, I'm looking at my room. So I figured it out. So far, everything up until the point where she came in, it's me talking to myself. It's me playing this game. It's not really a game, but it's me. My room was plain. My room had no color. My room had no smell. That was all me. Now she came along and she's a kid version of Santa, a female-ish version of Santa. I have no clue what the hell is going on. Let's not think about it. So again, this is me. Sorry. I don't have anything for you. I had absolutely no idea where she came in from. But she seemed rather harmless and cute. Damn straight. 
Okay, so she's Santa, supposedly. And then she says, you have nothing left. Yep, I've got no money. Damn straight. Just to let you guys know, uh, uh, this is literally me, uh, uh, to a point. She says, anything else? Well, I can't give you my computer. I can't give you my clothes. And I can't give you my books. They're my bare necessities, after all. Damn true, otherwise my YouTube channel won't be going so well. Still, don't you have something else to offer? Like what? Hopes and dreams. I've got none of those either. R really, I mean, I would love to do YouTube full time. So if you guys want, hit the subscribe button, fam. Smash the subscribe button. Well, actually, don't smash it because if you keep hitting it, it sometimes goes to, it goes back. You subscribe, you unsubscribe, you subscribe, you unsubscribe. Just make sure you finish it on subscribe. Yeah, I figured. Sorry, you might want to try somebody better off. Hmm? Hmm, she said, leering at me. Um, she then says, I won't leave until you give me a gift. Now, what paused me there for a second is I'm looking at the tags of this video. One of the tags is sexual. One of the tags is nudity. I don't know if I should keep going. Because I was starting to get the vibe of she doesn't want a gift. She wants the gift. Is this a Christmas? What is this? Is this is this Christmas hentai? What's what's going on, fam? Whatever, do what you want. Oh my gosh, I think this is where it comes in. Am I hallucinating? I don't think you are, bro. Or am I dreaming? I mean, I'm technically talking to myself. The the kid Santa let out a joyous chuckle while she ran around me in a circle. Today is Christmas. And not really. Well, actually. Nope, it's 12.34 p.m., so it's technically 34 minutes into Christmas. I couldn't even tell which real or not anymore. To be honest, I, it didn't really matter. Uh, all that was clear was that this cute kid Santa wasn't going to leave me alone. Underage, uh, FBI, FBI, 12.24, Christmas Eve. I locked my door. And doing that made it seem like I have sealed myself into my very own private world. A tranquil one that I won't be disturbed in. Do I get to do anything? Do I get to make any choices in this? All I needed to do was to close the door. Out of the lack of miracles, expecting nothing. The only thing I need in my world is me. Me, myself, and I. All I need is a world with a population of one. Me. But... What the hell, she came back. Santa was still tirelessly orbiting around me. Oh, she, she's still running around me, just running around and So why did I lock the door with her in it? She's starting to get on my nerves. I sit. Oh, I said sit. She sat. For some reason, it feels like she'd give me her hand if I say paw to her. Oh my, no. Let's not do that. Yeah, I don't think so, bro. So who exactly are you? She said she's Santa Claus. Santa Claus is supposed to be an old, fat, white-haired man. We all know who Santa is. She is not Santa. She says you're wearing a school uniform. Still, Santa Claus. I guess she's right. After all, I did realize that she was Santa right after seeing her. How? Why is she blushing, Van? How was I able to do that? I'm not sure, but there are those times in life that you just want to forget about it all and do as your heart desires, right? It was one of those days, Christmas Eve, the one time in the year where everyone just wants to forget about reality and live in their dreams. Weren't Santas extinct? What the f- There's more than one? So she managed to survive by wearing a school uniform. That's how Santa started wearing his school uniform. How does it feel like to be a cute girl? Costume play? Feels like cosplay. So is Santa wearing... 
an outfit and she, he's not technically the girl. Santa's depraved. <clears throat> no, no, I'm still Santa in heart, even if I wear a school uniform. Then why are you taking the presents away? I thought Santa was supposed to be giving them. Withdrawing. Withdrawing? That's what I wanted to say. Yep. I'm taking back the things I gave away when everyone was little. What? Why? Since I loaned it to you. Loaned what? You know, uh, hopes, dreams, future, that sort of stuff. Wait, you were lending those? Yep, I was gonna take everything back, but with interest. Uh, back with interest, but. but. Everyone went bankrupt. <laughs> Santa was actually a loan shark. We were all being deceived. So basically, you're here to repossess the hopes and dreams you gave me when I was younger. Yep. And I'm going to take them back with interest to the very last penny. Sorry, I'm broke as well. Uh. Santa twitched as if she had taken a hit to her emotions. Twitch, twitch. That was kind of cute. There's a deadline. A deadline? The 24th and the 25th, so today and tomorrow. If I missed the deadline, I would have to return this uniform to its owner, and then Santa will go extinct. Uh huh. Wait, why? <clears throat> well, because Santa can only escape the danger of going extinct by wearing a school uniform and becoming a beautiful girl. This totally makes no sense, fam. That's not very easy to understand. Therefore, Santa looked as though she was planning to explain it to me. Once the 25th passes, anything I do will be pointless. Why? Because today and tomorrow are meant to be the most fantastic days of all. Fantastic? Fantastic! Ah, fantastic! Yeah, fantastic! Fantastic day! So Santa... Okay, we gotta, we gotta stop talking with the accent. So Santa has to collect her payment in full within the next two days, huh? Yep. It's urgent. Sorry, I literally have nothing. Uh. Wait, I'm scared. It's morning. The sun is rising. Even on the most fantastic of all days, the sun rises like any other. Sun, 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 sunny day. Christmas Eve is a sunny day. Ah, it's not fantastic at all. I'm guessing the sun is not too fond of the snow from the way he killed them all. But the snow's not a lie. Wait, well, actually, it is kind of. If I guess H2O, it heated and melted them away. Poor snow. Sun tends to always be like that. Sunny places are always like that. Reality is always like that. Santa. What? Where's Rudolph? I grew. What? Did he? What, what am I at? Whoa, I should be shocked. What are we talking about? He... Taste. Oh, what the fuck? Tears. So she had to eat Rudolph. Santa was starving to the point where if she didn't eat her beloved Rudolph, she would have perished. How did it get to this? Well, since all the kids who received my loan went bankrupt, I'm also broke. Oh. Rudolph. Rudolph. But it's fine. Rudolph is inside me now. We'll be together forever. I mean, technically gonna poop him out. How was Santa meant to get around without Rudolph? Without Santa walked. You walk? I know Rudolph was able to fly, but just because I ate him, it doesn't mean I can fly now. Not even if I painted my nose red. We decided to have a moment of silence for Rudolph. I'm just so confused on what's going on here, team. How long is this game? Or this story. It's, I don't think I'm making any plans. Any changes. Nothing's going on here. So, what do you plan to do once the 24th and 25th is over? I'm going to make more hopes and dreams for the next 363 days. And with those, and with those, and with those, I'm going to distribute them all on the 24th and 25th. Santa is great. I see. Oh, it makes sense though. Because you have hopes and dreams. 
in life. Technically, those hopes and dreams are your presents, if you will, that you receive on the 25th, which is December. Santa, during the 363 days that isn't really pure Christmas themed, um, is basically doing. Santa's not real. Fuck it, I'm done. I've fallen on hard times with the factory, though, so the factory is now a pile of debris. Why? Because the children who borrowed the hopes and dreams from us all filed for bankruptcy altogether. Oh. Gimme. Gimme. Sorry, but I don't have anything. Did she not know this? Well, I don't know why the tag was sexual, but... Is it the 25th yet? Nope. Still Christmas. Oh. The morning went by, and it is now noon. Afternoon, huh? Afternoon. I want to see snow, white snow, a white panoramic landscape. I want to see a beautiful white scenery. Go away, sun, let the snow fall. I'm hungry. Santa is starving, you're hungry. Rudolph is crying out that he's hungry from inside of me. Rudolph, you're alive? I have ramen if you want. I don't Ramen is lit. Don't talk bad about ramen, Santa. We could always starve. You bad de debtor. The creditor forced violence on the debtor. A knuckle to my forehead. One minute of recovery. I passed out. What? How did I pass out from her? One minute passed. Rebirth. That's a relief. Hey, I wouldn't die from that. Impossible things could also happen on this fantastic day. Fantastic day. I can't afford to be careless on this fantastic day. Santa. What? Why did you start lending hopes and dreams to kids? Well, I was selling them at first. You were selling them? Yep. For how much? Despair. Despair? If you sell your despair to us, we'll give you hope. How does that work as a business? I don't know. Why or how, but it sure was popular. And then? But at some point, humans stopped selling it to us. They said they couldn't give it to us even if they wanted to. What do you mean? They hold on to it like treasure, but scream for help to separate it from them. <clears throat> That's why we started loaning the hopes and dreams to them. Why did you lend it to them when you could just as easily have given them away? They tend to be thrown away if we give it to them for free. You threw it away too, you debtor. Stop. I was hit. I, I, I knew I was going to be hit again. I was hit on the forehead by a fist. For playful jest, it was unexpectedly strong that I nearly fell over. Anyway, so since they were throwing them away, if you just give it to them. You started loaning them out instead? Yep. I plan to have them return with a lot of interest. Mm-hmm. But everyone went bankrupt. Oh. Give it back. Give it back. Sorry, I got nothing. Come on, she's gotta know this by now. I'm 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 pointless. Is this the only theme that I get is this room? It was now late in the afternoon and the sun had returned home. I gave Santa a cup of water. How is it? Rudolph doesn't like it. You honestly think I can satisfy my hunger with just minerals, he says? Oh, Rudolph, you don't plan on being picky with what you eat in your current status, are you? Santa? Yes? What do you plan to do from now on, Santa? Since this whole thing about lending isn't working out, shouldn't you try something else? Hmm, can you try and come up with a plan? Hmm, we decided to contemplate for a minimum. I don't know. Uh, just when I thought this loan shark idea was good and original when I came up with it. You sure you weren't just being greedy? You know, with the interest and in all. It's a bit. You doctor, I swear, 10 years ago, you definitely pinky promised that you would pay it back to me back by 100 times. No, 1,000 times. We even went as far as spit shaking at it. This Santa, no matter how I look at it, there is no denying that she has a deeply rooted sense of resentment. Give it back, give it back. You promised to give it back at a hundred, a thousand times its original worth, didn't you? Sorry, I lost it all, so I have nothing left. Uh, 
You could almost visually see Santa's heart sink. <laughs> Seriously, what am I supposed to do now? For the first time, Santa is showing some true sense of anxiety. Santa, we've wasted a day. Christmas Eve is almost over. Oh, there we go. It's gone. It's Christmas Day now. I see. Christmas Day. Here we go. Christmas Day arrived without a slightest show of mercy. Looking outside of the window, I could see the snow dancing in the wind. Yay, it's snowing. It was snowing quite heavily. I wonder if... I would see a sea of white when I opened my eyes tomorrow. Santa, do you want to stay up all night? No, kids need to sleep early. I'm an adult now. Nope, just like how my mind is still Santa even though I'm wearing a school uniform. Your mind is still that of a child even though you appear like an adult on the outside. Mind. Appearances don't really matter. What's important is the way you feel in your heart. My heart is always Santa. Good night. Santa pulled the blanket over herself and lay down on the bed. I followed suit and pulled the blanket over myself and lay down too. Are we in the same bed? For some reason, we ended up using the same single blanket. Oh no, I think this is where it goes down. Sweet dreams, Santa. Sweet dreams, kiddo. Just call me kiddo. What is this? Is the creepiest thing ever. Alright, now it's Christmas. Here we go. We woke up. A new theme in the background, please. So am I still in my bedroom? I mean, I technically. Ooh, we're outside, fam. It's actually a pretty game, I'm not gonna lie. December 25th, Christmas Day. Although the outside world was brilliant and spotless. The spiteful sun in the sky had the every intent of obliterating everything. The sun was killing the snow. Fractal by fractal. Santa. What? Hmm. Can't you just ask the sun to leave us alone for a bit? After all, it is meant to be a fantastic day, right? Try asking it nicely. Hey, sun. Scram. I was ignored. Reality is always like that. Sob, sob. Santa has made a snowball and started rolling it in the snow. What are you doing, Santa? <laughs> <clears throat> I'm making a snowman. Aha! I also started to roll the snowball. Roll, roll. Round, round. Round, round. Round, 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 round. I finished making the smaller ball. Santa has finished making the body portion of the snowman. I'll put the smaller ball on top of that. Do we get to see it? I think we do. Yay, we do! There's our little snowman. The snowman was now complete. Now what? If we just leave it here, the sun's going to come and kill it. Yeah, I know, right? It's like a mayfly. A mayfly? An insect with a fate of only living a day in its lifetime. The snowman is going to melt by tomorrow. Uh, you're happy when it's there. But once it's gone, you'll forget about it as if it never existed in the first place. Uh, not really? What should I do? Santa gave me a peek from the corner of her eye. Only 14 hours of Christmas left. 14 hours of a fantastic day left. Only 14 hours of hope left. Once today is over, it will all melt and die. We have to find a way to keep it before- Okay, so just Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. That's just like the day, just, just, just basically enjoy it. Just enjoy the day that you get off in life with people around you. Surround yourself with good goodness and pretty much just enjoy the two days, fam. It's, I mean, that's pretty much what it's all about. That's what I'm getting from this. That's what you hope for, and uh, once basically the day's over, you back back to shit. Not really. Should we put it in the fridge? Then it won't grow. It'll only going to get hard and stiff. The sexual innuendos, fam. Then what exactly should we do? Santa looked depressed. Is there really nothing else we can do? Santa looked at me. I tried giving them out for free. I tried loaning them out. Neither of them worked. Being Santa's a tough job. I don't see any light. Mm. I'm the last one, you know. Mm. All the other Santas died out. I'm the last one standing. Who's responsible for that? You, you debtor. The creditor swung violence at the debtor. Again, I received a precise blow to the center of my chin. That really hurts. Pain is a cheap price to pay. Huh? 
I've thought about it for an hour, and I was just rolling snowballs for the past hour. Any good ideas? Hmm, I did, but it's not the best of all ideas. What is it? Why don't we go on a strike and protest outside the city hall? Don't. Well, giving out hopes and dreams is labor too, you know. No one is going to take you seriously. It's it's pretty true. Are we back to the? Oh, wait, what's next? How long is this game? Okay, we're back in my room. It was late in the evening. We returned home. Santa, it's dinner time. But why does it have to be school uniform? Couldn't you have gone for anything else? A Santa who wears a school uniform is forever in their teens. Teens? Although my heart is Santa, since I'm wearing a school uniform, my appearance is also forced to be that of that of a teen. Hmm. Hey, you should wear one too. Uh, what? No. Once I came to, I was wearing a school uniform. This is weird. Feels like I've reverted back to being a high school student again. I'm technically still wearing some Adidas top right now. It's not really a school uniform. <laughs> looks good. It looks good on you. I mean, if that was a school uniform, I would definitely be down, but... Well, I mean, for the females, but... I never went to school where uniform was required, except elementary school, where we just had to wear collared shirts, red, white, or blue. Santa looked pleased. Santa no longer has any powers, so all she can do are the small things. Hmm? But since I made it for you, you have to pay it back to me by a thousand folds next year. What did you make? Hopes and dreams. What? what when? The school uniform. Uh, the school uniform is hopes and dreams. Well, it was always inside you, so all I did was pull it out. All you need to do is make it bigger. But it feels like it's going to melt and die by tomorrow. Santa. I'm sorry. If you're sorry, then pay me back, you debtor. The creditor didn't swing violence at the debtor. Santa looked at me blankly. There's no time. What? There's only an hour left. Oh, so there's only an hour left of Christmas. It's impossible to obtain the hopes and dreams within an hour, isn't it? Santa, I have a request. What is it, debtor? Stop calling me that. Come back next year. Next year? Yeah, next year. Hmm. Are you going to be okay with that? Honestly, not really. I'll give it my best shot in gathering my hopes and dreams, but the sun's too strong, it might be gone by tomorrow. Even if that does happen, I'm still wait patiently for the fantastic day, until the day I can borrow hope from you again. You debt do you even know how much debt you're in right now? How much? I gave you the loan when you were seven, so you have 13 years worth of interest to pay back. So I'm technically 20. Good to know. What do I have to do to pay it back? Give hopes and dreams to 13 other people. Wait, you're telling me this was pyramids? This is a pyramid scheme. Santa has to put bread on the table too. Cool, Santa. So basically to pay her back, I have to pay 13 times the initial amount. Technically, technically, she's just asking you to be nice to other people. That's it. Alright, I'll come again next year. If you haven't given hopes and dreams to 30 people by then, then I'll add interest and increase it by tenfold. 130 people? <laughs> you aren't able to reach the quota by the end of the uh, year after that? Then I'll raise it to 1300 people. Wow, you're like a dictionary definition of a loan shark. <laughs> the corrupt lender smiled. Work hard. Yeah. The South and North Pole won't melt. Mm -hmm. Even if it melts at first, you just have to make it bigger and firmer until it gets to the point where it can't melt. Put it in the fridge? <clears throat> then it'll only become firm, but not bigger. Uh, work hard. Yeah. If the sun kills it again, I'll grant you a loan on the next fantastic day. And you'll increase the quota by ten times. Of course. Wow, and I'm guessing that this is going to keep going down? The tiers of your pyramid scheme? Yep. Try raising the numbers up to somewhere in the million. Impossible. That's just impossible. It's fine. The pyramid makes it possible. Ha. The short Christmas is now coming to an end. You're really going to come next year, right? Yep. I'm not sure what's going to happen to me by then. Me neither. Even so. Even so? I'll wait. Promise? I'm not going to make it promise when I have a feeling that you may break it. This debtor. Christmas is coming to an end. You aren't going? I have one last thing to say. What is it? Thank you. 
Why, you were the last one. Last what? You were my last customer. Ah, well that's a relief. I didn't lose my job. For some reason, the sight of Santa smiling felt faint. I'm going to make it 130 hopes and dreams by next year. So, yeah. Let's call it 13 for now. I'll bring 130 next year. By then, I might be able to get some help. Hmm. The year after that, 1300. The year after that, 13,000. And the year after that, 130k. Wow. If it grows that big, I'll be able to run my factory again. Santa. Hmm. What's your dream? To give people hopes and dreams. I see. Yep. Work hard. You too. She has hearts in her eyes. Don't really know what happened this whole time. I technically didn't even get to do anything in this game except freaking click the space bar. The clock hit 12 and Christmas day was over. December 26th, the fantastic day was over. Though my heart still felt fantastic, yes there is a risk that the sun may kill the fantastic feeling once I open the door and step outside. Even so, even so, even so, let's open the door. If you put it in the fridge, then it'll only become firm, but it will never grow. Let's hang in there for a year. Let's hang in there while I give people hopes and dreams. I'm looking forward to Christmas next year. Goodbye, Santa. I will wait. Is that it? I'm going to sleep? What the hell's going on? I thought I was going outside. I think that's it. Nope. Wait. She just said that, but that, that was it. That was the whole game. Hmm. Well then, that was a Dolcent Santa. Don't really know what happened. I, re I really don't. If you guys can describe that storyline to me in the comment section down below, let me know. If you want to see more videos like this in the near future, let me know. That was kind of a weird game. All I had to do was press spacebar and read a weird storyline. Don't know why there was a tag for sexual content and there was a tag for nudity. I didn't see any, so I'm kind of uh, bummed about that. But anyways, catch you guys in the next one. Have a wonderful Christmas. Happy New Year. I'll catch you guys tonight and tomorrow. We live streaming seven nights a week. We upload seven days a week. Peace out, everybody.